let's take a look at number 42. Uh, northbound train left at noon. Uh, two hours later, southbound train left the same station. At 5 p.m., the two trains were 315 miles apart. Find a rate of each train if the northbound train traveled 15 miles per hour faster than a southbound train. Okay. I hate, I hate distance, uh, distance problems. Train left the station here, and blah blah blah. They're all based upon this. Distance is equal to r times t. And we got a northbound train. So it's going, let's say, this way. And then we have a southbound train, which is going this way. Um, let's see. Northbound train left at noon. So they left at noon. Two hours later, a uh, southbound train left the station. So two hours later. So they left at 2 o'clock. Uh, at 5 p.m., the two trains were 315 miles apart. So total distance between these trains is 315. So they're working together to achieve this distance. So um, we're going to have the rate um, and time of the northbound train, RT of the northbound, plus rate times time of the southbound is going to work together to achieve the 315. Now the R and T of these will probably be different, so realize that. And uh, one of them is given to us directly, it looks like. Um, it says at uh, 5 o'clock, they're, they're th at that point. Well, if this one started at noon, and it's now 5 o'clock, the northbound train has been going for 5 hours. So let me put 5 in there. Now realize the R here is for the northbound. I'll put a little N to indicate it's different. And the southbound, it started at 2 o'clock, so from 2 o'clock to 5 o'clock is 3 hours. So this would be 3 times R of the southbound. I'll put an S there to indicate southbound. Okay, let's see what else they give us. <coughs> they say, um, find a rate of each train if the northbound train traveled 15 miles per hour faster than the southbound. So they're putting the northbound in terms of the southbound. So southbound will leave as is. It'll just be R. But for our northbound, we said that it's, um, what did we say? 15 miles per hour faster, which means this will be R plus 15. For example, if southbound was going 10 miles um, per hour, then this one would be going 25 miles per hour. At this point, we want to solve this. This is a linear equation. 5 times r is 5r, five, 5 times 15 is 75, plus 3r is equal to 315, 5r plus 3r is 8r, plus 75 equals 315. Uh, solving linear equation, you get everything with an r on one side and numbers on the other, so I'll take the 75 over to the right side, it becomes a negative 75. Combine together numbers at any step, um, 240. Yeah, 240. And last step, divide both sides by the number in front of your r, which is 8. And we get r is equal to 30 miles. Now that's the southbound. So southbound is going 30 miles per hour. And if the northbound is going 15 miles an hour faster, they'll be going 45 miles per hour. So let's see what in the world they're even asking for. Uh, find a rate of northbound, find a rate of each train. Uh, that's nice. Doesn't say which is which. Um, what do we what do we get? Thirty and forty-five. So thirty and forty-five would be A. So forty-two A would be our answer. Forty-two A, and that checks.